Every day is, is a discovery. And I think that's what's most exciting about, about the field. I'm a professor in uh, electrical engineering and computer science. Um, I'm also director of uh, a new NSF center here at uh, Michigan called uh, CFOAM, uh, the Center for Photonic and Multiscale Nanomaterials. Um, and in the past have been director of the Center for Ultrafast Optical Science, which is an interdisciplinary research center within the, within the college here. Uh, my research is focused on ultrafast optics, uh, femtosecond lasers, and their applications in both uh, optoelectronics and in uh, biomedicine. We have um, probably three main projects or project themes at the moment. Uh, one is in graphene, and lots of people have heard uh, about graphene as the, uh, as the electronic material of the future. Uh, we have been using ultrafast lasers to study how fast uh, electronic processes work in this material, which is very important as, as, as perhaps the main promise of graphene is for high-speed electronic devices. Uh, our uh, secondary research that, that is closely tied to that is uh, terahertz optoelectronics, uh, both terahertz imaging and terahertz spectroscopy. So this is very far infrared uh, radiation um, that we can use to study uh, processes that are relevant to high-speed optoelectronic devices. The third area that we work in is in biomedical optics. And that's in a collaboration with the Michigan uh, Nanomedicine Institute uh, over in the medical school. And there we're looking at different ways of using optics as uh, biomedical sensors, either in vivo, where we actually insert optical fibers, for example, into the body to make optical measurements, or uh, doing sensor measurements, uh, for example, to measure molecular binding uh, outside the body. So ultrafast optics is uh, the specialty of this lab and is really what uh, one of the things that Michigan is very well known for. So the Center for Ultrafast Optical Science has been here since uh, 1991 and uh, was an NSF Science and Technology Center for 11 years and since then has been a College of Engineering Interdisciplinary Research Center. And it focuses on making pulses of light that are as short as can be, which is just a few femtoseconds in duration. And also, with very short pulses, you can make extremely high peak power. And so, uh, QOS is also home to Hercules, which is the, uh, the highest intensity laser uh, in the world at, uh, at this time. My own research focuses on low intensity but ultra-fast processes in optoelectronic opto materials. So what I like most about teaching uh, is, is working directly with the students and then, and then seeing the light bulb go on. Uh, uh, they come into the program uh, like I was, kind of unsure and, and not really knowing very much. And, and what you do in the course of their time here is you, you turn them into colleagues. And uh, by the time they come to you with their own ideas and, and they know more about the subject than you do, then you know they're ready to graduate. And, and that's what's, what's most interesting and satisfying.